1492, when Columbus sailed the ocean blue, what was among the treasure he brought back to Queen Isabella? Squash. Just one cup of acorn squash has 145% of the vitamin A you need in a day. Vitamin A helps fight the signs of aging, improving vision, building bone density, reducing wrinkles, and fading age spots. I bet you Queen Isabella appreciated that. Sweet, nutty acorn squash is the food as medicine ingredient in my warm and filling Chef MD approved baked stuffed acorn squash. Today, I'm filling a beautiful acorn squash with beans, herbs, and spices, and some nutty seeds for my Chef MD approved baked stuffed acorn squash. Most squashes are stuffed with brown sugar and butter, but we can make a meal instead of a dessert out of this one. Watch. Place it on a sheet pan like this. The sheet pan you could line if you wanted with aluminum foil or with parchment paper, or you can just use the baking sheet like this. You'll still get over a thousand milligrams of potassium from this dish, plus you'll get their wonderful vitamin A. Pop these in the oven. Uh, for 30 or 35 minutes and they'll become concentrated and sweeter. Next step, we're going to toast some beautiful quinoa in an already warm pan, which is a seed, not a grain, has all nine essential amino acids together with some garam masala, which is a wonderful Indian spice mix. If you don't have garam masala, you can use a curry powder. The quinoa begins to darken just a little bit and then, just after a few seconds, you can add the vegetable broth and let this cook. The quinoa is done when the little curlicue comes out of it. I'll show you it in a moment because I have one that's done, to which I've already added chickpeas, very high in protein, and orange zest. Let's pull out the acorn squash. It should be about done. Now, fill this with a little bit of quinoa chickpeas, orange zest, high in protein, high in anti-inflammatory compounds. And now the toppings make this dish. Here are some pumpkin seeds, wonderful anti-inflammatory, very crunchy and nutty. A little bit of chopped mint as well, gives it some sweetness and some pomegranate glaze. Pomegranate glaze you get from just boiling down pomegranate juice and thickening it. You can put it around the plate like this if you like or drizzle some right on top. A bit of salt on the acorn squash and we're good to go. Man, that looks great. For the complete recipe, check out our website. And remember, the fountain of youth starts in the kitchen. Chantani, may you live 100 years. For Chef MD, I'm Dr. John LaPuma. Learn more about culinary medicine today. Order Chef MD's Big Book of Culinary Medicine at chefmd.com and sign up for free weekly recipe emails while you're there.